my friends hello everyone this is Mithal Hasso today we're gonna make a WWE champion world heavyweight championship this is a really easy and beginner tutorial I hope anyone can follow along really really easy so first I need a reference so I created these and these are the I'm gonna use the same uh, with texture as well so load this and add it in a layer and then start with the box or you can use a plane let's use a plane press J scale it press space then press this button press T and then okay so that's it guys so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna go to vertex first I'm gonna just like adjust adjust it okay so that's it now I'm gonna insert some edge loops okay right here maybe right here and then try to like this a little bit higher like this like this this as well so maybe I could uh, maybe I could do is uh, like uh, you know what to do time slide fast this process so you can just know what I have to do I know this is a really boring process trying to you know duplicate and do this kind of step is really boring projection as well we're gonna use same like this model to project oh sorry same use this texture to project our belt okay so maybe use some this so this is done okay so now I'm gonna do I'm gonna clean up this history so now I'm gonna go to assign favorite material I'm gonna choose Lambert go to Lambert 2 then assign your file I'm gonna go to the desktop my desktop is really 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 a mess I'm really sorry for that I'm gonna press 6 and now you're gonna see what the hell is this <laughs> I'm gonna control S save it the what to say like I think I'm gonna use this this precise thing right there a little bit okay so guys this is our title I'm gonna press control one so now we have to do is a little bit of cleanup okay little bit of cleanup I mean like you're gonna press W press control shift route mask button and enable preserve UVs then go to vertex and clean up your edges this 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 maybe insert one edge loop 
and like this, like this. It's just a little. I think I'm gonna press insert edges and clean up your model. It will take some time, so I and press Control E and press this guy and like this okay now I'm gonna press back control one now I'm just using go to the front view F and now I'm gonna use this buckles to shape up my belt as well so that's it that's same right now I'm gonna go to the vertex like this like this like this 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 is really a uh, you know beginner level tutorial and to be honest I'm not that good <laughs> in other things as well I'm not that good in these kind of things as well sorry guys I'm just an insecure person <laughs> really insecure person okay so yeah I think that's what I'm good I'm gonna go to perspective view <coughs> and now I'm gonna now I'm gonna uh, select these faces and mapping planar map Z because these are direction on the Z axis and now I'm gonna go to UV editor UV editor is your best friend okay go to UV shell take it and place it right there Okay, just close it. We don't need this, so just like this. Press this and then place it right there so guys this is called texturing and it is really used in especially in video games if we use a lot of texture because you know if we use uh, mo if we model uh, you know what to say like if we use a lot of models we can like I turn the nightshade view on so if we use a lot of models we can decrease the optimization of the game because especially we use i work in i used to work now <laughs> because now in these days i'm not doing any kind of job try to freelance but i don't know how that works really weird experience of freelancing now it's looking a little bit good just let's smooth this area no let's not do smooth anything <laughs> forget about smoothing okay guys so that's your championship belt 
Yay! Preserve UVs and I'm gonna draw a roll. Like this, okay. Now it's looking good. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna control E and increase the thickness of our title. Okay. Now what we're gonna do, we're gonna go to we're gonna go to left view and select all the faces and then just like these faces just like these faces okay then go to again favorite material you can take any material right and I'm gonna plug a leather texture into it so my leather texture is must be in my WWE folder there you go like this and what I'm gonna do I have really good trick go to hypershade the uh, select this and select object with material just off on this one okay that's it hit control one go to face select of faces and go to uh, mapping and planner map z maybe a project and unfold now there it is i'm gonna maybe scale it for a good you know this leather effect so yeah guys this is your title i'm seeing a little bit of problems I'm gonna adjust in the UV editor. Roll one. Go to UV. Just try a little bit. A little bit of baby. In his hand, he's got a little bit of baby. Do you remember John Cena versus Bray White Fuel? Uh, 2014 I really love that feud guys I'm a huge fan of WWE right okay so that's your championship belt maybe I do a little bit of baby to this one preserve UVs damn shazam okay so that's it guys now what we can do That's not working. Okay, so now what we can do, I'm gonna go to. I'm gonna plug a bump map to it. So go to bump mapping. If you don't know how to create a bump map, I will make a video how to make a bump map in Photoshop. New folder, new folder two, and that's a normal map I made for this image. So if we can see we sync a little bit. Oh, this is uh, what to say. Like, I'm gonna flip this. Uh, like, because the world heavyweight champion is uh, flipped it, so I'm gonna select this, press shift, and go to flip along you. That's it. But we are made a mistake, so we have to readjust it maybe. Or it's looking good no. now from every side vertex please this and 
there you go guys your world highway champion and now what i'm gonna do i'm gonna bring this to substance painter because you know i'm a huge fan of substance painter and what he do the export selection title e okay texture current session import and yeah that's it go to file go to new Here are textures, texture, textures. There you go. So, Lambert, this one is. I'm gonna go fill here and I'm gonna drag this at here. No, I'm gonna drag this to here. And that's why, guys, the con naming convention use re are really handy. <laughs> so, now I'm gonna in this one create a fill layer and drag to this one right here now I'm gonna go to the normal map of this one and I'm gonna drag a normal map hmm that's looking good world heavyweight la champion <laughs> oh wrong universe sorry normal map and it's looking good as well maybe I use this one as a metallic one what happened if I do metallic yeah that's looking good really good guys look at this one guys look at the depth of this WWE world heavy now I'm gonna go to window mood pirate huge fan of Irie I don't know this I don't like this ugly one so I'm gonna go to panorama and change it to another thing wow WWE title on the street right it's looking really weird Hmm. How about it, guys? Do you like the video? Do you like it? I'm gonna save render to 